Hello, and welcome to a mini episode of the Drog Creations podcast. My name's Nicole, and I'm coming to you from Calgary, Alberta, here in Canada, where I live with my husband, Barry, and my beautiful, wonderful, rescued Rottweiler named Grace. So, I am not normally podcasting at this time, but it is because our crochet along, our make along, has come to an end. So for January and February, we were running a make along in Ravelry um, based on color work and color work crochet and knitting and, and all the color work things. Um, that uh, along did end as of February 28th and I have drawn some winners. So I would like to come on and just announce those winners um, get that out of the way. I, yes, I'm very excited. But before we do that, I just want to say to everybody, happy Mardi Gras day. It is Mardi Gras today and I am not in New Orleans. I am here in snowy, cold Calgary. <sighs> one day, one day I'll be in New Orleans for Mardi Gras. But until then, let's get on with the podcast, shall we? So I have three prizes that have been drawn. Um, one from the finished objects thread, one from the chatter thread, and one from the Instagram feeds. So first off, I would like to say a huge thank you to everyone who participated. Um, as I said in the last podcast, it got off to a little bit of a slow start, but you know what? People jumped aboard and it was really exciting to see. Um, exciting to see everybody's experimentation and color work. There were some fantastic projects. Um, very inspirational things coming through there. I was very pleased and and I hope you if you were following along that you You know gain some inspiration from your fellow crafters out there because you know If we don't have each other, who do we have right? So It's the announcement time So let me see let's start out with the first prize package which is here beside me and it consists of a on-the-go project bag created by yours truly. Um, it is green with beautiful embroidery or crochet, um, scissors on the outside, and inside is just plain white. What's nice about these bags is they do fit over your arm. You can put your, your um, yarn in there and you can crochet or knit or do whatever it is you need to do as you're walking down the street. How perfect is that? I've dropped my paper, hold on. All right, I'm back. So, first prize uh, being drawn um, is from the Finished Objects thread, and the winner will receive this bag. Um, these cute little mini charm hooks. So it's three tiny, tiny crochet hooks that are on a ring, um, just in case you ever have a crochet hook emergency. It looks like there's a size three, a size four, and a size five in there. So emergency crochet hooks and a mini skein of um, 2575 uh, sock yarn. It is a mini skein from Polka Dot Creek, which is a yarn, yarn dyer um, in Airdrie, so not too far from me. Um, and I bought a pack of mini skeins and this is one of them. So that will also be in the prize pack for the finished objects prize. And the winner, are you ready? I've made you wait long enough. The winner of the finished objects thread is T for Talia. I hope I'm saying that correctly. Thank you so much for participating. Um, if you reach out to me via Ravelry um, with your address, so send me a message in Ravelry with your address and I will get your prize off to you as quickly as I can. So congratulations, T for Talia. And that was post number 32 in the finished objects thread. All right, moving on to the next prize. So the next prize is the prize from the chatter thread. Um, and again, the chatter thread was, was quite active. We had people asking some questions and people getting involved and it was very exciting and, 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 and wonderful and exactly what the chatter thread is meant to be. So the chatter thread winner, your prize consists of a Durab Creations over the arm um, on the go bag. It has, on the outside is um, 
deer in a, in a, yeah, just, it's a very vintagey looking fabric. Um, on the inside is uh, blue with stars. So there's that. To go with the bag is a crochet journal. Um, one of the, ni the nice thing about this crochet journal is it does have little holes on the side where you can hang um, your yarn from. So you could, you know, record what your project was and then attach some samples of the yarn that you used as well. So that is going into the project peg. And finally, a mini skein of yarn, again, Polka Dot Creek. It is a 75-25 sock yarn, fingering weight in a beautiful burgundy color. So that is the prize for the Chatter Thread. And the Chatter Thread winner was post number 29, Nancy Gorst. G-O-R-S-T, Nancy Gorst. I hope, again, I apologize if I'm saying anyone's name incorrectly. Um, but Nancy Gorst, please reach out to me uh, via Ravelry. Send me a message with your, your address and I will get this in the post to you as quickly as possible. All right, one more to go. Um, and this is the winner from the Instagram th uh, feed. Now, the Instagram feed was kind of funny because for a while there, I had more posts in the Instagram feed than anybody else. <laughs> but um, after my announcement last podcast, more people did jump aboard and did post in the Instagram feed. Thank you so much. Next time, I think I will choose a shorter Instagram hashtag um, to make it a little easier for people to join in that way as well. But let me show you the prize for the Instagram feed. Starts out with a surprise, surprise, uh, over the arm, on the go project bag. This one is blue with uh, balls of yarn on it. The inside is just a plain white. And to go along with your new project bag, you will be getting a set of two bamboo crochet hooks a 2.5 millimeter and a 7 millimeter. And finally, a mini skein of fingering weight, 75-25 sock yarn from Polka Dot Creek. So there is a beautiful skein, mini skein of green, 75-25 um, sock yarn, uh, good to do toes, um, heels or cuffs, or to put into a scrappy blanket, or to do a multitude of things with. So that will be in there as well. So, on to the winner's name. So, the winner from the Instagram feed is, um, it was the third post in the Instagram feed, and that is, I think, I think I've interpreted this name correctly, as Dis is 19 this is 19. I will put all of the the names of the winners down below in the notes for the uh, the show as well. So again, thank you very much for participating. This is 19. So that's it. Those are the three winners and the three prizes. And you may remember that uh, the lovely Hannah from Cozy Cottage Crochet has also um, generously donated prizes for this podcast. Thank you so much, Hannah. Um, she has uh, said that she will um, be gifting each of the winners um, one of her patterns. So go to Ravelry and check that out if you are one of the winners. And I will be sending your Ravelry contact to Hannah. Um, and she will be getting in contact with you in regards to that pattern giveaway. So uh, once again, I would like to thank everyone for participating in the Drop Creations Colorwork Cal 2019. Um, stay tuned later this week. Well, I guess it'll be the beginning of next week. I will be releasing a full podcast episode. And in that episode, not only is it my podiversary, but we will be announcing the beginning of a new crochet along. Actually, we're not calling them crochet alongs anymore. I'm going to call them create-alongs because I want them to be open to as many as many fiber crafts um, as possible. So that's that.
That is the end. That is all I've got. Congratulations to the three winners. Thank you so much for participating and thank you for tuning in. Um, I also wanted to throw in here very quickly a big thank you to all the subscribers. Um, my numbers are steadily increasing and that just warms my heart. Um, if you do like what you see here, by all means, hit that thumbs up by button, um, hit the subscribe button. Um, yeah, and come back and join us. As I said, a new podcast episode will be up in less than a week. All right, everyone. Thank you so much. Happy Mardi Gras, and we'll see y'all soon. Bye now.